So you get a massive infestation in one of the areas in your base. What I thought I'd do is show you here how to deal with that. There's an easy way. Obviously, you have to worry about them breaking through the walls, but if you can contain them, and you can see here, this has grown over time, so it's a massive infestation. I've got one of my guys here. He's got an incendiary launcher. Now, either an incendiary launcher or molotovs are good for this. What you do, fire in, have him escape quickly through the door, like so. Make sure you've installed a door. And then keep firing until you can get the fire going in the hive. You can see here, he's had to fire a few times. But you really want one of those central shots so you can get enough stuff burning. And you can see here the hive, and there are like 30 or 40 of these alien creatures inside here. And they're good fuel for this fire. And they're beginning to burn. I'm going to get him in again just to add some more flames. Unfortunately, I failed on that attempt because these little pesky aliens, they... If they see you, they'll run towards you and attack. You can see the fires burning. Now, the goal here isn't just about the fire. It's also about raising the temperature in the space. And it has to be enclosed for this to work. You can see some of them are beginning to ignite within the space. As the temperature rises and the fire burns. I've sped it up a little bit here. You can see little fires starting off in all the little aliens around the location. At this point, the cryogenic sarcophagi or chambers bust open and these ancient pirates wake up into this inferno and soon pass out as the heat temperature rises. We're almost at 2,000 degrees now. Nothing stands a chance. And it's just a question now. My guy hanging around outside waiting for the flames to burn out because there's only a certain amount of fuel. We're enclosed in a rock chamber. That's important. It has to be rock, limestone or granite around the outside here. That will not burn and eventually the flames die out and you're left with the stuff with a lot less stuff than you would do if you went in with guns blazing but you would get lots of injuries and it would affect the mental state of your colony. You can see what gold and bits and pieces there. Guys, I hope you found this useful. If you did, click the thumbs up. And don't forget to sub if you haven't already. Thanks again.